Hello guys, Amman872. I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak your iPod Touch second generation on 3.1.3. So to start out, you're going to need an iPod Touch. You're going to need a cord, a USB cord for your iPod. A uh, Macintosh with the uh, iPod Touch 2G 3.1.2 firmware, surprisingly. Um, because that's the firmware that's going to have the patch for it. Okay, so basically... Um, you, uh, are basically want to just, uh, restore. If you're already jailbroken, you're going to have to pretty much restore. Um, okay, so, yeah, so if you're jailbroken, you're, you pretty much have to just restore. It's, um, kind of a pain, but that's how, um, updating is when you jailbreak. So, get used to it. Um, and, uh, if you don't want to jailbreak, that's fine, too. Um, so just go ahead, open up iTunes. And uh, I do just, I recommend that you just restore. So I have just restored, as you can see. Nothing is on my iPod. 3.1.3. Um, okay, so go ahead and close iTunes after you do that. Um, then you're going to want to download Red Snow from the link in the description and uh, open it up. This is a special Red Snow 0.9.4. It will only work for the iPod Touch 2G on 3.1.3 alone. So this, if you have like any other iPod or iPhone, use the uh, 0 0.9.2. Okay, so go ahead and click Browse. And um, you're going to need to download the iPod Touch or iPod 2 comma 1 um, underscore 3.1.2 underscore 7D11 underscore restore dot IPSW. If you don't have this, um, usually when you restore it in iTunes, it'll put it in your trash, um, so you can, uh, try and find it. If not, I'll have a link in the description for the Felix Bruns website, and you can download it there. Um, just click open, and, uh, if you try choosing the 3.1.3, it's gonna say there's an error. Um, I don't have the MC model. If you have the MC model, it will close your, uh, um, if you click yes, it will just close it. If you click no, but you still have an MC model, you're going to have to restore on iTunes because it's going to try and jailbreak something that is not jailbreakable. Okay, so click next. It's going to download all the uh, information that you need. So it was pretty much patching the firmware right there. Okay, so this is where uh, it's kind of kind of become important. Um, because on your device, uh, as you can see, I'm not jailbroken. So there's the little dismiss. I just restored, so there's no apps. There's just the spotlight search. Um, so really quick, I want to show you. Just make sure you don't have the MC model. Go to general, about, and then right there it says I have an MB model. If you guys can see that, I'll try and zoom up. Yeah, I can't zoom up anymore, so let me just show you guys. I have an MB model right there. It just says it. Um, okay, so there we go. We have that out of the way. Um, now what you're going to want to do, if, you, uh, if you're if you already jailbroken, you're just changing your boot logo. Um, so say you don't have your boot logos right now, you can go ahead and click already. Uh, you can install Cydia this time, and then next time around, you can just click already pumped, and it won't erase your jailbreak. Um, so verbose boot basically shows the code going down your iPod. That's pretty cool. Um, then the custom boot logo is, uh, you can actually have a custom boot logo and a verbose boot, which is pretty, pretty neat on uh, my end, I think. And custom recovery logo as well. Okay, so I have all four checked. You guys only have to check install Cydia. You, so you click next. Now basically, you're going to be putting it in a DFU mode, so you just plug your iPod in, then turn it off. If you try and do it, uh, if you try and, um turn it off and then plug it in it's just going to turn back on okay so once it is turned off let me just zoom out a little bit okay so it as you guys can see click only when your device is both plugged in and turned off okay hold down the home button then add on with the power button and then release the power button but keep holding the home button and hold it about until it gets to about 23 seconds and then it will do whatever it needs to do. Okay, so you can let go now. Okay, so let me just put it back in my little stand.
Okay, so that is the classic downloading jailbreak image that they've always had um, since Pwn is Chul and Win Pwn and stuff. So, all those files I was downloading a couple steps ago, it is uploading to your iPod Touch. Okay, you can go ahead and click finish. It will speed up your computer quite a bit. Um, not really. I'm just joking. It's not going to do that much. Um, then, pretty much the rest of this is on your iPod Touch. Um, this uh, is pretty much right now, besides Snow Breeze, um, this is really the only Macintosh um, program out there, but this is also for Windows too, so that's always good. Um, Snow Breeze is only for Windows. I think they should make it for Mac, but I, I do like uh, um, this Red Snow better just because you don't have to you know restore your whole iPod if you want to jailbreak. I guess the same can be said about uh, Snow Breeze because you can make a NOR only file. And I'll have both of these uh, recovery of all three of these in a folder. You guys want them? Those boot logos. Say what you want about me. Okay, so we are almost done. And if you guys are wondering how I tape this, and this is the uh, verbose boot. See, it shows the boot logo really quick and then goes to the verbose boot. Um, if you guys were wondering how I tape this, uh, I just use my Flipman OHD and I just turn it on its side with my uh, bipod. Some bipods can do that. And then in a, in a screen flow, I just turn the angle to like a 90 degree. Okay, so here we go. Let's check this out. Um, if we swipe to the next page, we have Cydia. So I'm just going to put this on my home page really quick. Okay, so if you guys do want rock, you can get rock right out of Cydia. And the thing that's good about this is because, um, hold on really quick, I'm just going to type in my password. Okay, so I have my password. And the thing that's good about this is because you don't need to, um, update Cydia, it just reorganizes and you're done. Okay, so thank you guys. Hope you enjoyed this jailbreak. Make sure to subscribe.